science, Miss Right here. Now that we know multiplication, let's dive into division. And division means sharing equally, okay? When a problem asks you to divide something, you're splitting it into groups. So let's say we want to know what 12 divided by 4 is. We have 12 divided by 4. All this is asking us is how many groups of 4 make up 12. To write it in a numerical style, we will just do 4, 4, and 4. Because 4 plus 4 is 8, plus 4 is 12. That means 3 groups of 4 goes into 12. So 12 divided into 4 is 3. And if you want to check it, And if you want to check your answer, you work backwards. Four times three will give you 12. Let's try another. Let's do 15 divided by five. So if we have the number 15 divided by five, what is this basically asking you? How many groups of five will add up to 15. So we know 5 plus 5 plus 5 is 15. Do you think the answer is 3? Yes. Three groups of 5 will give you 15 because when you check it, 5 times 3 equals 15. Also, 5 plus 5 plus 5 will also give you 15. I think it'll help if you just envision division as splitting objects into piles. What about 20 divided by 10? How many groups of 10 will go into 20? So yes, two groups of 10 will go into 20. To check it again, 10 times two will give you 20. When you wanna see the groups written out, one group of 10, another group of 10. This plus this gives you 20, which means it is two groups that make up 20. So yes, your answer is two. Before we get into our next row, I do want to bring up the number two. When you divide by the number two, you are splitting the number in half, okay? So if we have 10 divided by two, what's half of 10? Five, right. If we have 12 divided by two, six. Now it gets a little tricky and we'll work on that later on if you have a number like 13. 13 does not have equal numbers to just simply add. Unlike 12, 12 will be 1, 6 plus 1, 6. 6 plus 6 is 12. Whereas 13 will be 6.5. And we can get into decimals later on in the curriculum. But as far as this riddle goes, Make sure you grab a piece of paper. We're going to read a riddle from my riddle book. The secret code to open a treasure chest is a three digit number. The first digit is four. The second digit is twice the first digit and the third digit is half the first digit. What is the code? Let's go to the board and figure it out. All right, so it says the secret code to open a treasure chest is a three digit number. That means we're going to have one blank, two blank, three blanks, okay? The first digit is four. Okay? The second digit is twice the first digit. So we can either do four plus four 
or since we know how to multiply now, we're going to do four times two, which will give us eight, okay? The third digit is half of the first digit. So we can simply just, what's half of four? What equal number adds up to four? That will be two plus two. But since we're working on division, we are going to focus on four divided by two. Hey, remember what I said, anything divided by two is half of the number. And to check what half of that is, we just try to figure out what number plus itself will give you four. One plus three, those two numbers aren't equal. Two plus two is equal. So half of four is two. So the three digit code is 482. Well, that was fun. Next time we're gonna learn about some lines, their features, some shapes. So make sure you keep practicing your division and everything else that we've learned. And I'll see you next time. Bye.